Hey guys, so today I'm just filming a quick video straight from my computer. I haven't uploaded in forever and I'm so sorry. YouTube doesn't let me post videos from my laptop anymore so that caused a lot of problems. But I have videos scheduled now so there should be a video like twice a week. Hopefully if everything works out. But yeah, so today I'm going to be doing my Boat of Books 11.0 TBR video. This was a total last minute decision because the readathon starts tomorrow, like Monday, and it lasts a week. But this is technically my last full week being at home until I move off to university. So it is the last chance I have at a readathon, and I haven't read as many books this month as I would like to. So I picked a few books, but I'm also currently reading a couple. So yeah, let's get right into my TBR. So the book that I picked up this morning actually is Speak by Laura Hell Sanderson. Um, my friend Ashley from Ashley's Cup Excitement, I will link her to channel down in the description. She mentioned this book in her wrap up and she really enjoyed it. So she motivated me to pick it up. And if you don't know what it's about, it is about a ninth grader named Melinda. And school is just starting, but everybody hates her because she called the cops on a party and people got arrested and all that stuff. So she has a secret of actually what happened. So but she's not telling anybody, so yeah. I'm about 60 pages in, and there's only about 200 pages, so I don't know if I'll finish it today, because my brother's on today, and I still want to go to the gym, so who knows what will happen tonight, but I am enjoying it so far, and I'm sure it will just get a lot better. Then I'm also about 100 pages into Legend by Marie Lu. I'm reading this with my friend Keisha from The Forsaken 707, who I will also link down in the description. Um, yeah, we both wanted to read this for a while, so we finally decided to read it together, and yeah, so. It's okay so far. I think I like Day more than June, just because June almost seems kind of naive, I guess, to kind of everything that's going on, whereas Day is very involved in everything going on, if that kind of makes sense. Um, but I can kind of guess where the story's gonna go. I didn't read the synopsis either, so I went into this totally blind, except for all the hype. So, yeah, this is pretty good so far, too. I'm just waiting for it to really grab me, I guess. So then I picked three books that I would like to read. I doubt I'm going to read five books this week. It's a busy week, but I am going to the beach sometime soon this week, so I hope to get a lot of reading done there. But something I know I want to read is Rumble by Ellen Hopkins. This was also on my TBR for the month, but I'm supposed to be posting a review for this next Wednesday. Not this one, but the next one. So I would really like to get it read because I'm sure it's going to be fantastic and since Simon & Schuster sent me an art copy of it, I feel obliged to post it. But yeah, this comes out on the 26th and it's written in verse so it should be a quick read. Maybe I'll take this one to the beach. Then for these last two, it's probably going to be one or the other and the one I picked, ironically, the next one is The One by Kara Cass. This was on my TBR for the month because I really just wanted to get the series done and then I found out there's going to be a fourth book and that really irritates me to no end. Um, so I'm probably going to read this and I'm going to count it towards my finished series challenge because it was only supposed to be a trilogy so in my mind the fourth book doesn't even exist. So yeah, the selection series isn't my favorite series but I just want to get the series finished so I'm going to read this and then I'm going to call it an end and just... Move on. And then finally, I have We Were Liars by E. Lockhart. When I was at DEA, I was talking to a lot of people and they loved this book, but nobody would tell me what it was about because they kept telling me that I should go into a blind. So I'm very intrigued and I've heard a lot of good things, plus it's also short. So that tells me it should be good for a readathon. And yeah, so obviously I have no idea what this is about. I think it's a mystery. I think. I'm not sure. Nobody would tell me and I don't want to read the synopsis because if people are telling me to go into a blind I will trust their opinion. So those are just quickly the five books that I hope to read. Um, probably unrealistically. I would like to at least get through two or three of them I think. Um, so yeah if you don't have me on Goodreads I will link it down in the description so you can keep up with my progress but I will definitely talk about all the books I read in my wrap up. So yeah I've missed you guys and I will post another video on Thursday, one of my back to school supply haul videos. And yeah, so thank you guys for watching. If you're participating in this readathon, let me know down in the comments and what you'll be reading and stuff. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you're having a great day. If you are participating, good luck and I'll talk to you guys on Thursday.